up buddy nerdigans this is the one and only packer girl 89 today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for mary machida arumikun chapter 234 so before i get into this recap and live reaction let me just remind you to hit that like share and subscribe buttons and because of course this channel let alone this video are not sponsored and i'm just on a non-stop high speed struggle train heading into chaos and ah oh, we have hit hyperspeed and panic attack levels of struggle up in y'all. <sighs> but if you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive and a kick in, feel free to hit up my Cash App and PayPal. Those links are in the description box below. So we're starting off this year with Parsons' backstory, which I'm really excited about. And we're going to see Parsons' bro, which, remember, his bro been missing. So this is going to be very, very interesting. I swear to God, if we see him by the end of this arc, I'm going to goddamn die. I will die laughing. Anyways, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us this week, and see how we're going to be starting off 2022. Here we go. Bruh! Ooh, ooh, cute, cute, cute! And this chapter is titled One with the World. Are you playing with your toy trumpet again, Soy? Dude, <laughs> uh, you really like it, huh? But now, be quiet for a moment. Perton, ooh. Perton, where are you? Perton, da. Shh, listen carefully, Soy. Don't make a sound. Imagine ice cream melting into the ground on a sweltering day and slowly, slowly blend into the air around you. I know you can hear a lot of noise right now, but you have to block it all out. Soy, you are now one with the world. <laughs> the title of the chapter. Let's see what you're doing here. Mmm. Honey, have you seen Soy? Uh, you're as lovely as ever. No, and I can't find Person either. Uh, where could they have gone off to? Let's look for them. Ma? Soy? Uh, where are you? Soy? He's crawling. He's not here. Um, he's not here. Maybe he's in a different room. Um, must have misheard then. Let's go. Oh, look at this. This art is great. This is, I've talked about this before, where I want like some, in terms of art, where I want something that gives me that extra oomph. This is it. It says shock right here. I see the shock. I see the expression um, in the face. I see like the, those extra lines that in the gray and um, the shading. That's the word I was looking for. And the shading on the face and um, the little bit of, uh, of extra lining here in, in the horn, going through the horns and the body. It just gives you that oof, that like, <gasps> that shock. Ma. Soy? Oh, oh, poor baby. Where did he come from? Perton. Oh, man, I even told him to stay quiet. You failed to report to me after your mission again. What were you doing? Soy is... Um, I'm sorry. Sorry to you too, Soy. <sighs> Looks like you're still a bit too young, but I'm sure that this lesson will help you one day. Oh, man, did it ever. That's the only memory I have of my brother. Shortly after that, he vanished without a trace. He didn't play a big role in my life, so I wasn't really sad about it. His face was invisible all the time, after all, but now I have to remember that feeling, even if it fries my brain. This isn't the same as when I'm usually uh, using my ability. I have to imagine digging even deeper. Focus. Focus. Um, and share this power with my Kohai. Slowly, slowly. Whoa. You okay? Um, I'm fine. I just tripped. Uh, ooh. Um, fabulous first year, uh, Sayer, Sepata, Bloodline Magic, Flexibility. That is boss. As long as he has mana, he can stretch any part of his body. Ah, uh, that was close. I'm so sorry, Senpai. Huh? His face is gone. Imagine ice cream. You have to blend into the air like melting ice cream. 
You can hear a lot of noise right now, but you have to block it out. Now this is what you call a Bluperia sketch. Yes, and you know what? Normally, you would think these are unfinished panels. Normally, but this is a situation where you can tell this is these are not unfinished panels because it works because you are in this invisible world. You two are now one with the world. Amazing. It's like our bodies became nothing. Nobody sees us. No one's noticing, even though we're right in front of them. He's just too amazing. And it's interesting because if you think about it, what Soy can do is very, very incredible. And I think he might be able to do it better than his brother um, for a couple of reasons. Or actually, the main reason being is because Soy is able to become one with sound because of his music, right? He has that ability. If he can combine that, with becoming one with the world um, via becoming invisible, <gasps> that will be out of this world. That will take it, that will be like, like a mega evolution of this. He will truly, he might not be one with the world, he might be one with the universe at that point. I'm curious what you guys think about that. Look at that though, in this panel where he said, where it says he's just too amazing. Look how cool this looks. This art is freaking incredible. It's just so ethereal and light and dreamy and otherworldly. It's beautiful. And you know what? You know, when you do like yoga or something or meditate and they say to become like one with the universe, this has gotta be what they mean, right? So gotta wonder if maybe if this is maybe if you do use um Soy's method, the Parson method, maybe you could be one with the world. Maybe even one with the universe. <laughs> um they're gone. Are we safe? Um did I do a good job? I'm Aww. Uh oh. Oh, <gasps> Oh shit! Yum! Oh no! Oh no, we got caught! Did he get the balloons? He got both the balloons! Oh no, we got both the balloons! No! Bastard! But how did he see them? How did he see- did he, didn't he make the balloons invisible though? Oh no, he didn't make the balloon, did he, or no, they must have become visible, and, hold on. Oh no. 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 What do you guys think happened? I, it looks like they might have become visible again and they got the balloons. Yeah, because the balloons weren't visible either. They must have become visible again and it got snuck up on. Oh, that sucks. Sucks. But damn, I'm really proud of, even though Soy is knocked out of this, he did a fantastic job. And... Now we know a little bit about his brother. We don't know much about him, but we're gonna see him at some point. And you have to wonder if the point we're going to see Soy's brother is gonna be when he becomes one with one with the well, well maybe one with the universe, maybe. Hold on a sec.
trying to see. Because I'm thinking maybe Parson would be able to see his brother. I think he might be able to see his brother. So the question will be if uh, Purton is going to come to him or is he going to find, is he going to find Purton? But when will it be? I think it's going to be a matter of when. I don't think it's going to be right away. Nah, nah. Do I think it's going to be in this? It might be, you know when it might be? It might be in the battle against the fingers. We might see Parton. I would not be surprised by that. But I'm very curious what you guys think of this chapter. What do you guys think about this concept of becoming one with the world? And with Parton, and not Parton, I'm sorry. With Soy in particular, because he has his music, do you think he might be able to reach the next level or not? I think he might. I think he might be able to become even one with the universe because of the, because of music. I really do. I'm very curious what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive and kicking so I can keep bringing you more room content, a few ways you can do that. Donate to my cash app, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wishlist, all that's in the description box below. Also make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend me on PlayStation Network, that's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.